So you guys, what is Sober Curious for you? Clarity. It's courage. Mm, it's authentic and real. Yes. And it's the biggest adventure you will ever go on in your life. Mm. <laughs> I think it's the foundation because when we are clear-minded, we can hear the heart. And that's where our purpose and our passion and a meaningful life uh, lives. For me, sobriety is really a social justice issue in that it's one of the tools that people can use to get more connected to the difference that you're supposed to make and to wake up every day with the clarity and with the power to see that through. I not only feel better, I look better, I sound better, I work better, I love better, I do everything better. Being sober just helped me to accept myself and really be excited about my well-being, physically, mentally, and emotionally. I feel more clear, I feel more empowered, and I feel more present in my body. I get like amazing sleep every night. Um, my gut feels completely good and calm the whole time. My skin's really clear. All of these amazing things, all from not drinking alcohol. Sober Socializing 101. Go to all the places and have sparkling water. What I've done when I feel anxious in a so social space, I actually will remove myself from the space and like take a breath, you know, treat myself to a few kind words or even call somebody. You don't need to let everybody know that you're sober. Um, one of the things that I often do so that the conversation doesn't come up over and over again is that when I'm offered alcohol, I just say, no, I'm okay right now. You know what? Well, my advice is water tastes amazing. Get, get into it. Like, water's great. Water is really great. Water is just as tasty as my old favorite Pinot. And <laughs> that's really that. If whoever you're dating can't accept your sobriety or your sober curiosity or you know not drinking, they're probably people you shouldn't be dating. It gives you the opportunity to find yourself in the present moment with another human. And even if that's scary and you have to take a lot of deep breaths, that's the true you. Going on sober dates, the conversation is just better. It's kind of like you're not slurring, you're not forgetting things, you're hearing everything they're saying. And when you really click with someone, you can really feel that click. You don't really understand how much power alcohol might have over you, your thinking, your health, your presence in the world and your work until you stop drinking and you get sober curious.